We're buddies. <laughs> cool, man. All right, ready? Let's go. Team, go! Let's do it. All right, drop in. Mr. Tonka. All right, we just landed in Tampa. I got my rental car, a little Volkswagen, like station wagon thing. I'm curious how uh, Alafaya utilizes terrain here. I mean, it is flatter than South Florida here. Holy crap, let me turn the camera around. There's not even a hill. It's all farmland. I hope this bathroom's there. Alafaya State Park. I forgot my helmet. I forgot my chesty. I forgot my bike. Am I forgetting anything? I don't know, but we got Mr. Tonka. Joe's up front. And look who returned. Stefano. Yeah. Lines of MTB. We got Nick, a local shredder. And we're just going to rip some, uh, some trails and show me around. Stefano, do you know anything about Niner bikes? Not at all. So I'm on a Niner something. I don't even know. Plus bike. Jet RDO. Jet RDO. And it feels pretty good. It's like a tra mid-travel trail bike, plus tires, getting these little sandy turns. Case. Hey, this thing feels pretty good. All right. I'm like an Alafi State Park already. This is pretty cool. A roller coaster. Should be fun. So literally we are in a swamp. It's gonna be a lot of talking today. It's hot. Very creative use of the land here. There's a decent little drop. Okay. One eye jack. <laughs> oh, this is so cool. <laughs> Tight. Whoa. Holy crap, it's tight. This whole trail takes place in like a quarter of an acre. I think that's the tightest trail I've ever done. On the left side here, you can go down there. There's a little tiny table, which is a lot of fun. Yeah. Because you can rail it. And you can go down this wooden ramp right here. If you go straight, there's another table. It's right. kind of more of a BMX style lip. Yeah, poppy. And then if you go to the right, there's a maybe like an eight, 10 foot gap. Ooh. That's what sucks about rental bikes. It's hard getting them dialed in. But it feels like a pretty good bike. Fox 34. A little better. Get this whip. There you go. That's all I got. <laughs> That's all I got. That's good, dude. Skimble's gonna be toast by the end of the day. I'm dropping so much sweat in it. Yeah. No. Bumping the table. Now we get the mini gap. It's about an eight foot gap, I'd say. Seven, eight foot. But the the landing area is sketchy. So. It's really so smooth, though. If you just keep all of this out of your mind, 
it's like boom, dead on. Your heart's going? Definitely. <laughs> Sorry about that. <laughs> oh, yeah. Woo! Well, here's the swamp. <laughs> Man, you use the crap out of your dropper here. It is up and down. Look at this green stuff. It's like swamp things gonna pop out of that shit. Yeah, no pollution. Niner's feeling good. Pedals well. Getting these little punchy climbs. Uh, you get the yep. Uh. Nice. Yeah. Ooh, my brakes heating up. Check line. <sighs> Roller coaster. I wonder if my footage is going to be a little more shaky now with the regular chesty. I haven't worn one in so long. Well, Alright. Drop coming up. So that's how you can spot Joe's channel. He's got a little Tonka truck. Woo! Uh, for his avatar. So I will leave his channel, Mr. Tonka, in the description below. Go check it out. And you guys know Blind Stuff MTV. But I'll leave his link to his channel too. So check it out. Both good shit. God damn, this is fun. Dropper utilization here is crazy. Good place to test the dropper. Oh, yeah. You know, if it makes it through a couple of runs here, it's good to go. It is up and down. <laughs> All around. Plus, tires feel good in these flat turns. Gravitron. Now that we're all cold and everything. Oh, I feel good. I'm, we'll go get the hardest trail in the park. <laughs> I took a piss. So I, I would recommend you spot this drop before you do it. Oh, we're going to spot everything. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I haven't been back here since the rain started. So Gravitron. 
experts only. Woo! That's cool. Get some speed. A little G out. Yeah, all this looks good. Oh, that's good. Looks like a little soft in the turn down there. So that double straight up flow. Yeah. I hate how it's in a bowl. But I'm, I'll do the drop and bypass it for it's now. It's really good. You just go over this slow. Yeah. And um, yeah. It's all good. I love drops. But um, but I don't know about that double. So we got a drop coming up here, and it's like a step up double, which is doesn't look that bad. I'm sure if you hit the speed right. It's good, but I got to go to work later, so. Oh, this is not actually not that bad. Zip. Joe, there's a little mud in the turn, so yeah. watch out for that. It looks nice and packed down at the bottom, though. Yeah, it looks good. Stick. So this way you walk it, because you know you wash out in this stuff. And then uh, mud, so you got to be careful there, but this, uh, this double, I might bypass this today. If I lived here, I'd be hitting this mofo every day. In a little room. Oh, I just went for it. Yeah. <laughs> Front tire hit first, though. Uh, I cased it. I needed to pull up. Yeah, you cased it, but nice. you just got your front tire over it. Close, I know, I was like, I just held it straight like I'm like, just don't go over the handlebars. We're buddies. <laughs> cool, man. Team go! Let's do it. All right, drop in. Mr. Tonka. There we go. <laughs> that was smooth for me. I like just picked up the bike just enough. Dude, sweet. This thing climbs nice! Kew! Digging this Niner. It feels like a uh, Ibis Mojo. Nice playful trail bike. With big fat tires. Green looks pretty nice. But I guess Niner's out of business, right? So... Who bought them out? Leave in the comments below. This right. one, that lift is much steeper than that one, so... Okay. A little boosty? A little bit more, yeah. Okay. If you really learn the trail. You can flow the crap out of this thing, huh? I, I can imagine. A little more speed than that. Just kind of float it, but. Yeah, that fun. It's not dangerous. It's just like, everything's built really well here. Yeah, you gotta get past the fact that you're like on a bench cut in the swamp. Yeah. As long as you do that, the features are all kind of normal. Yeah, you just look at a trail as it is. And if you look to the right here, We've got alligators and all sorts of shit. God dang, it's like... So drop. A little drum. Whoa, into rocks. <laughs> Case. It's all right, yeah. I couldn't see the, like... The landing, you see how like the bridge drops? So I was right. like, where is it? How far does it go? So I just cased it. Oh. <laughs> Sorry. That's all right. No worries, man. Oh. Hmm. Oh, nice. This is uh, <laughs> what pissed me off is I never get that climb. Yeah, you need to get that climb, right? To be comfortable with the drop, I do, yeah. It's not bad, I just feel like you need a little bit of speed. I can do it from right there. Uh, yeah, I don't need to clip in for that. That's so smooth. Yeah, it's nice. Another little one. Yeehaw! <laughs> <laughs> I 
Low branch. Oh, so this is the infamous, this is what I saw like a million times, like you guys hitting. Yeah. This. <laughs> the drop is fine. The thing's like on an angle. That's really steep. Yeah, I can see it. That's like a, a vert ramp almost, a quarter pipe. Oh yeah, total BMX jump. Yeah. All right, folks. We're in the swamp here. We have Mr. Tonka. He's an exotic species and he's going to go and hit this drop. It is his mating call. This is how he gets the female with the step up jump. Will he do it? Will he clear? Stay tuned. Made it look easy. There will be lots of females attracted to him now. So l has got some facilities, bathroom, water. Um, so it's nice. Nice state park. I guys just finished up the ride. Alafaya State Park. Mr. Tonka, Joe, thanks good for job. showing us around. Stefano, always good, a pleasure. Yeah, good nice seeing you again. again, brother. Wines of MTB, go check it out. And the, uh, the Niner, super impressive. I'm digging it. But I don't know who makes them now. I guess they're out of business, but frame's really stiff. It was real playful. Um, good components, just besides those crap guide our brakes, I just can't stand them. That's just personal, but everything else hooked up. Some um, some hardcore MTB uh, venture capitalists bought Niner. That's like, what it is. That was the plan to go out of business, yeah. so that they could make it. They could make the sale. Yeah. And so now they made the sale. Now they're refunded and they're coming they're out. Booting out. Yeah. I wonder if this is a new one. I don't know what year this is either. I don't know anything about this bike. It looks pretty new though. I'm, I'm going to assume it's a 2018, just by the fork, because it's got the new. 18 Fox 34 on it. Yeah, so it's gotta be. Yeah, so I think it's an 18 model, the uh, Niner Jet, 9RDO. I'll do some research and I'll leave uh, a link uh, in the description below. But uh, there's my man, Nick. Hey, look, he actually looks like Mr. Tonka right here. Right. <laughs> hey, Nick, good ride, brother. Thanks, man. Hey, ripping on the camber. We're moving today. So I forgot to say, size medium frame, 5'10", 175 pounds, and no cracks. <laughs> Way to go, Niner. Thumbs up.